everyone, this is Cover Rope. I'm the CEO for 3rd Infantry Division and Spearhead Gaming. Put this quick video together, help you join the community, apply to the Milsim group, download, install the mods, team speak, all that good stuff. First, if you don't have Discord, you need Discord. Download, install Discord, I'm not going to go over that in this video. You can join the Spearhead Discord by using the link in the description of this video, but chances are, if you're watching this, you've already found us. You land in the Roles and Rules channel located at the top of the Discord. Read this top to bottom. Navigate to the Role Picking channel either on the sidebar or by clicking the provided link. Once here, select the Milsim role by hitting the 1 reaction. Then navigate to the Applications page either on the sidebar or by clicking the link provided. You can copy the format for the application by going to the pin messages at the top of the Discord window and then copy and pasting it into the messages window. Fill in the information on the application and you're good to go. If you're having an issue finding your Steam UID, you can also just link your profile page for Steam. The easiest way to find this is to open up your Steam client, go over to your name, select profile. From here you can select the web address for the page. If you can't see it, go to view, go to settings go to interface and then hit display web address bars when available. You can then just copy that and then paste it over into your application. It might take a few minutes before your application is accepted, but after it is, you'll be given the 3rd Infantry Division role, which will give you access to see the 3 ID and other Milsim channels. Navigate to Milsim Server Info here on the sidebar and then download any presets that are in the channel. After you've saved the HTML files, open up your Arma 3 launcher. Once your Arma 3 launcher is loaded, go to Mods, go over to Presets in the top right, select Import, and then find the HTMLs that you just downloaded and select them. You can only do these one at a time, but after all the mods are downloaded and updated, you can then work on installing Task Force Arrowhead Radio. To install Task Force Arrowhead Radio, you're going to need TeamSpeak first, so go download and install TeamSpeak. I'm not going to cover the installation for that in this video either. Once that's done, you need to navigate to your local files for Arma 3. To do that, open your Steam library, right click on Arma 3, select properties, go to local files, and select browse. Once the folders opens up, it should look something like this. You need to navigate here to the workshop folder. If you don't see this, go to the top of your Windows Explorer, hit view, and then make sure that hidden items has been checked. Go into the workshop folder and find at Task Force Arrowhead Radio Beta. It's important that it is the beta. Then navigate to the TeamSpeak folder and run the plugin that's in the folder. Make sure that you run this plugin as an admin and make sure that TeamSpeak is closed when you run it. After that, you should be all done. Make sure you log into TeamSpeak, check your plugin, make sure it's enabled then join our TeamSpeak server so we can get you the tags and you can get into the game. Reminder that weekend operations are at 8 p.m. on the East Coast and 5 p.m. on the West Coast. If you get the Combat Ready tag on Discord, you can be pinged for weekday patrols. Thanks for watching and hopefully we'll see you guys in the game.